Hi, so today in this quick tip tutorial we are going to learn how to create dotted lines. So let's start with it. There are two ways we, in which you can create dotted lines. First is a straight line that is dotted in nature. Otherwise you can also create curved lines in Photoshop that are shape layers and can be expanded to any size used in any number of projects and very easy to create. So let's start with it. So first of all we are going to learn how to create straight simple lines. So in the shapes menu at number 5 there is a line tool. Select it, click and drag to create a straight line. So now you can see it's a straight line but consists of a stroke and if you need a stroke or if you just need a fill you can choose from here so here we are not going to take the stroke so I'll just click on the stroke dialog box and I'll just choose this option so now it's a fill that is a white color so I'll make it a black color and here you can see there is a option where you can choose whether your line is to be a straight simple line or a semi dotted line and a dotted line so in, in this case I'm going to use this one so you can see the stroke has been enabled so this feature is a feature of the stroke option so in this case in, in this particular dotted line case we need to switch off the fill option and keep the stroke option on and then we have to make the lines like this so right now this is not working completely good because we have a stroke of 148 points which is very large if, if compared to a simple line so we'll just press control and click and drag towards left side so that we can decrease the number of the points and as you can see as we get into a reach of possibly correct points you can see the stroke but this this stroke does not look like a simple line this is more of like a dotted rectangle so for that what we are going to do is we can de decrease the height of the stroke and here you get a straight line which is uh, dotted in nature now we learn how to create a curved line that is dotted in nature for that I'll, I'm going to select the pen tool you can either click here or you can press P for the pen tool so now I'll click here I'll click drag and I'll click drag again so here you can see just because I have created a shape layer earlier this line also took the prop same characteristics that we used in the previous shape layer so if you have not created a shape layer earlier all you have to do is create a stroke like this turn off the fill turn on the stroke and in the case of a pen tool the height and width does not matter so if i if i increase the height it's the height of a o, of the overall stroke and if if in if you select this one and i increase the height it is the height of the object So let's work on this one now let's see that if we change the color of the stroke we can get a curved layer curved stroke what will these strokes be used for so for that I'm going to use I, I mainly use this these lines these curved lines just for creating curved arrows and for creating an arrow we need an arrow to complete this line so for creating an arrow you can just click here click here click here and click here but you can see that arrow arrow's body is also a dotted line that we do not need so what I what we are going to do is we'll switch off the stroke turn on the fill and leave this option to any of these three options because it, it is a property a property of the stroke and we do not have a stroke in this thing so here you get a curved line with an arrow hope you like and learned something and if you did, just press the like button and subscribe to the channel for more videos.